Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. John Megacycle here. Uh, another episode of Concrete Jungle coming at you. Uh, continuing on with the campaign. We just finished off Randolph. Now we're moving on to Cider Rapids. Excuse me. Bit of a hiccup there. Uh, Cider Rapids. Solo mode. Hard. Meet the mayor. 1,200 points for three stars. Let's do this thing. Oh, I get it. Like Cedar Rapids. Cider Rapids. All right. I get it. Hello, and welcome to the beautiful Cider Rapids. This is a famous national park in Greenbelt area. What is this? Hello there. I'm Rick Selfridge, recently elected mayor of Caribou City. Welcome to Selfie Park. <laughs> Selfie Park. You like the roller coaster? I designed it myself. Just between you and me, it failed its safety inspection this morning, so I would stay clear of it for now. Uh, close it? What? Unless you're feeling adventurous. No, I love his face. Durr. In which case, Godspeed to you. Oh my god, no. <laughs> what the? <f> <laughs> yeah. You must be Lainey Thompson. Where did you find the room in the budget for this? I assume you have corporate sponsorships? Lainey, I don't want the city to worry about silly commercial sponsorships. What? So that's why we don't have any. What? Look at the city's budget sheet. The numbers are all in the black. What? Those are clearly minus figures. What? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> My printer is out of color ink again? Oh, no. You wouldn't think that printing out a hundred colored birthday hats would take that much ink, would you? Holy crap. The mayor of the city thinks the budget's okay because the numbers aren't in red. They're in black. Marie. Marie, we're out of color ink. Who's Marie? We're the only ones here. <laughs> what the hell? Where are you going? We're not done here. Hey, he's gone. <laughs> I know this isn't your fault, but can you do some damage control for me? The mayor clearly doesn't know what he's doing. Holy crap, yes. Okay. Um... Okay, this is this is fixable. This is doable and fixable for sure. Um, okay, so let's talk this out here. House, house, house. That's the first row. Duplex green. House, house, house. That gets us out of this area, right? Okay, so let's do that. So duplex, house, house, house. Okay, this is three, because that's a one. I get it. So, green. Okay. Clear all the way through. Seems pretty legit. Oh, an invert card. Invert points on this tile. Expense is equal to the point difference. Add a red tape card to pick up. It sounds really cool. Also sounds kind of awful, but also sounds kind of cool. Um, let's do this with less houses, I guess. Oh, I get another duplex. I kind of wanted to save the duplex. Um, I also kind of wanted to save the school, but... I guess I don't really have much of a choice. So, school... Uh, the green here isn't necessary, because I'm going to put the duplex there. Duplex? Duplex? Duplex. Let's put the green here. I want to save that invert. I don't know what I'm going to get. So... There, I guess. We're not going to get a ton of points out the gate like we did with the last one, but we'll just have to see what's what. What is that? Oh, God, what? I see you've discovered Asthma Town. <laughs> <laughs> Named it. Named it Asthma Town. That's... A housing estate surrounding a chemical plant. I know. I thought the plant might be a really cool building to do paintball in. Oh my god. But then they told me we couldn't do paintball in it because of the dangerous chemicals. It makes sense, really. <laughs> Does it? Oh, how we laugh. <laughs> oh my god. You're a psychopath. Uh, okay. Ton of points, that's good. So now you know what the invert is for. 
Um, let's see here. Okay, I got a park square. That's pretty cool. A diner. That's pretty cool. A grove. If an adjacent tile's points are zero lower set to one, that's not bad. Hello? That was weird. My screen acted like I alt-tabbed out of it, and then it just minimized, and then it popped right back. I stopped the recording. Wasn't sure if I lost anything. Everything looks good. Okay, so... Was contemplating how to deal with Asthma Town, Asthma, Asthma District. I forgot what the mayor called it. Um, we've got an invert. We got a park square. We got a couple of nice things that's going to shift some points in our favor. Um, let's see here. Negative four. I'm, I'm thinking out loud here. A house is here. I'm going to need something for points, right? And then I'll put the park square here, I suppose. Then I'll neutralize some points, and then the big invert is going to be for this negative three stuff. So let's do that first. Negative three becomes a positive three, so it's a six point switch, and also gave me a red tape. Discard the following card. Well, it's continuous, so this is going to bump up my infrastructure costs like crazy. Or it's called expenses? Expenses? Hello? I think it's called expenses or expenditure or whatever. You just refuse to be... Oh, there we go. Nope. You just refuse to be cool about this, huh? Okay. Doesn't matter. Anyway, um, I don't want to burn a life as a force clear. Which I might have to do with that first one anyway. But let's see what we can do for some damage. Oh, I know how we'll handle this. Maybe? Maybe? have a grove if adjacent tiles points are zero or lower set to one that would actually work really well right there gosh I want to do this I want to do this correctly but I don't know how to do that <laughs> let's do park square here a house is here and I need a green that I'll chuck right there that'll take care of that no problem okay so here's our grove Cool. Done deal. We're looking good, okay? Just chuck the red tape, thank you. Oh, fire station. Ooh, excellent. That'll give me... Actually, I should chuck it here to normalize out four points. Okay, very good. So here's the green for that. Done deal, right? That'll turn it into a three. Perfect. A bueno. I've got some room. Um, I need to use this diner. Uh, this is so tricky. The park square here would be most effective. For sure. I'm trying to think of any way I can get this negative one into a positive three with the cards that I'm seeing right now, and I don't really see an option. So what, park here? Oh, that'll also take care of this column as well. The green here, so I need to get I need to get literally four points right here. And I don't know how to do that. The diner won't help. Uh, actually the diner will help because I can use the green for something else. Okay, let's walk through this here. If I put the diner here, I also need a house here. So, let's walk through it. Diner, green, park square. House goes here, for sure. No argument. Um, but I want to save it. Does a house go here, and then school, and then green? That would actually do it. That would do it very nicely. So, houses. Uh, I actually don't need the green. Oh, yes, I do. Green, school. Holy crap. We're like seven layers in here. And a house. Hey, didn't lose a single life. Look at that. Cheers, mate. Ah, look at all that clearing. Come. See that over there? That's my new convict education program. What the hell is that? Is that a pr 
prison and these are schools? This is a school? What? This is... Oh my god, what is this? It's a school surrounded by prisons. <laughs> so the convicts can learn about stuff and the kids can get life experience from the convicts. Oh my god. Everyone's a winner. No. Another chemical plant at the back there too? <laughs> what, like just for good measure? What the hell? Oh yeah, just one for good measure. <laughs> 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 All right, I like and I hate this mayor. Everyone's a winner. Oh yeah. Uh This game does a very good job, I'm going to say, giving you a much larger puzzle. It's up to you. Do you want to solve the big big puzzle or do you want to solve little chunks of it? I actually find that very refreshing. Um okay, house here. Right. Uh an invert. Another red tape, of course. Um, a park square. Uh, I'm going to have to do some work here. So, a green and a house. I don't want a ways to put a park square there. That seems stupid. A park square here would be good. Uh, that would actually lower the prison? I don't get it. Hold on. Let's figure this out. Prison. This building collects points, but inverts their score. Minus points are positive and vice versa. Okay, so that's dangerous. So I don't really want to put it anywhere there. Okay, let's put it there for two. Uh, discard. It doesn't matter because we're finishing this puzzle anyway. Diner there for two seems like a smart move. Um, I'd be very interested in a school. Oh, the park square is going to work out wonderfully, actually, in my favor. Green goes there, park square there, and that'll finish the puzzle. If adjacent points are zero or lower, set to one. Works for me. Uh, invert does me no good. Why not? Um, now let's just spend a little bit of money and see if we can boost our score by a bunch. So houses there makes sense. Green there makes sense. Houses, don't care. Uh, red tape, don't care. Red tape, don't care. Uh, park square, doesn't really matter. Um, I need a park square for down here to seal the deal. So park square there, discard. Houses, doesn't matter. Houses, doesn't matter. Red tape, doesn't matter. Does an inversion matter? Invert, doesn't matter. Houses, don't matter. Green... And Grove doesn't do me any favors. Just whatever. Red tape. The last green. And let's park square it. Oof. Yeah, all that expenditure. Negative six infrastructure or economy or whatever the heck that's called. Not too Welcome shabby. To water treatment world. Oh my god, what the hell is this? Enough! <laughs> Mr. Mayor, I'm begging you to stop this. You're ruining our city. God, that's good. Aw, poor mayor. Dump it a bump. Religious building. An adjacent building cannot be manipulated by impo imponents, ordinances, or link effects. Interesting. Huh, okay. Continue. I uh, got my three stars. Awesome. Uh, I had a score of 1410. I needed 1200. Bam! We shattered the heck out of that. All right. Cider Rapids is in the books. I'm going to call it here. Thanks for joining me. My name is John Megacycle. Another episode of Concrete Jungle. Done and done. And I hope to see you next time. Hey there, guys, gals, fans, and pals. Thanks for checking out my video. I also want to take a moment to thank all my supporters and donators, and if you'd like to join up with me and Game With My Crew, all the information to get connected is in the description below. Thanks again, and I hope to catch you next time.